All right, we are starting the first Fable, and it is on the Xbox 360. Man, almost 20 years old. That's me. Is that Lionhead? Yep. <coughs> Playing all the Fables in a row. Just to kind of get ready for the new one coming out, I believe, next year. Oh, wow, I didn't know this was Unreal. That's cool. Um, what? No. This one I've actually never played before. I've only ever played two, and I've played three. So we're going to jump into this. I don't think I have anything on the cloud for this game. That'd be pretty wild. Fable Anniversary. So we're going to do a new game. And you know me. If there's difficulty, I'm playing on the easiest. I don't need that other nonsense. I play games to relax, not get a headache. Demon Doors. We're built to protect all manners of secrets. Oh, well, okay. Thanks for letting me read it. Deep in the forest of Albion, lay the small town of Oakvale, unchanged by time and untouched by the sword. Here lived a boy and his family, a boy dreaming of greatness, of one day being a hero. Sometimes he imagined himself as a noble knight or a powerful wizard. And other times, he dreamt he'd be an evil warrior. But in all his dreams of greatness, he could not possibly imagine the power of the destiny that lay before him. Come on, wake up. Daydreaming again, were you? Just like your mother, mind always wandering. Well, let it wander off to find your sister, will you? <laughs> She's out playing by the Barrow Fields gate. Remember, you haven't given her a birthday present yet. Don't tell me you forgot to get her one. Well, I'm not bailing you out this time, son. Hmm. I tell you what, I'll give you a gold piece for each good deed you do around Oakvale. That should be enough to buy her a present. Now, get moving and stay out of trouble. Talk to people marked on your map with a green dot. They have something interesting to say and will highlight green when you approach them. Press A to talk to a highlighted person. So, should I just run across the whole map? Let's talk to this person. Let me hear some good reports about your behavior, and I'll give you some money for your sister's birthday present. Thank you. Okay, that's sneak. Whoa, this is, uh... It's clunky. Oh no. Her stuffing needs changing today, and I can't find her. Please help. Please help. Alright. She's a lovely little furry bear with a blue Why bear does my guy look so angry? The heck? Here's a stupid chicken. So I gotta find the bear. Should I go talk to him? Let me hear some good Ow. Maybe it's in here. Man, this is a clunky game. She never touched it. I had that night breaking last night. There's a big room in a night. I'm switching like that. I'm in the middle of the night. I don't think I ever want to. Harvesty 19. I had another dream. I was looping birthday presents out. I was so happy that something happened and it was so horrible and it woke me up. I think that's the only dream though. Harvesty 21. It's my birthday today. My mother forgets again, but at least my mother will be back. I got up early to look out over the sea and now I'm going to go play in the top field. Is that all I can interact with in here? in here. Old blankets. Father's clothes. Oh, no. Oh, they're not interesting. Okay, I keep forgetting this is too... Okay, that's how you sprint. A is sprint. Alright. Alright, we can't go in there. Can we go in here? Oh. Please find Rod. 
Let's see, where would a stuffed bear be? What do you got for me? Hello, lad. I'm a trader. I wander the world buying and selling wares, especially for the folk like your good self. Some little girl I saw said you have a sister. And it's her birthday. You haven't got no, it just so I have that I have a love and guaranteed to put a smile on any three gold pieces. Let's do it. I'm afraid you seem to be just free gold coins. Remember, your father will give you money if he hears good reports about you. Oh no, I don't have any money. Young tear away, off to play with your friends. There he goes again. Why does everyone walk around so weird? Honestly, this person walk? where's that filthy layabout husband of mine? Oh no. I don't want to get in the middle of this. With some woman, I don't doubt. I run his house, bring up his children, and what do I get in return? Nothing. Oh no. If you find him, let me know, won't you? We'll see. Honestly, where's that good for nothing husband of mine? Why is she singing? Oh, I keep pressing the wrong button. Oh, I can punch. There's Charissa. Uh oh. Hello, little brother. I hope you haven't forgotten what day it is, like you did last year. I would never. I'm sorry if I woke you up last night. It was another of those dreams. I was standing in this field when something happened, but I can't remember what. Never mind that, though. I'm still waiting for my present. Oh, yeah, your present. missing actually did I come from that way I don't think I did let's go up here his face. He goes around the town beating up anyone smaller than him. He looks like someone from Ed, Ed and Eddie. But you look strong. I bet you could scare him off for good. To attack a non-hostile character. What do you want? I'm just dealing with it. He was irritating me. Playing with my sister and a stupid teddy bear. Oh, he has the bear. No, he won't give it to me. Just because I said I'd rip his stupid head off. I told him, if he doesn't do what I say, I'm going to make his... So... Ow! Hey, it hurts! It hurts! I'm sorry. I'll leave him alone. Just please don't hit me again. <coughs> Good. Thank you. You're welcome. Here, I'll let you look after Rosie. She'll be safe with you. Alright, so I got the bear. Info. <laughs> Alright, so now we gotta go back to the girl. I haven't seen the husband yet, but that doesn't mean he couldn't be down here. Who's this? Oh. Oh, thank goodness. Listen, lad, could you do me a favor? I've got to, you know, answer a call of nature. Oh, stay here and watch this stock for me. There's a good lad. Just okay. stand between those two stacks and don't move. I'll put a good word in for you when I get back. Right, won't be... Won't be long. Stand between these two stacks. My cousin says that the barrels in these warehouses might have stuff in them. Quick, while he's away, smash his barrels up and see what's inside. Unless you're too scared. And come on, let's go and break stuff. What? What's that for? Oh, you're no fun at all. Oops. Are you just gonna stand there like a lemon? But being good is so boring. I just Wouldn't punched the kid. 
So I just gotta. Come on, there's still time before we get back. Oh, you're no fun at all. I'm gonna be good. I'm good. I can't believe I punched him. I feel like an idiot. There he is. Excellent, thanks, lad. You've done me a big favor. You're welcome. I'll let your dad know what a splendid watchman you made. Thank you. So, the husband wasn't here. Who's this? Yes. You found Rosie. I did. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Come on, Rosie. Let's change your stuffing. That's three good deeds. Dude, I'm a legend already. Look, there's an it right. Got you, you little ruffian. What did I do? I've heard reports that you've been doing bad deeds. What? Violent conduct towards a person or persons without God's permission. Uh, that sort of behavior is not acceptable. If you were older, you'd be apprehended and fined by the town guards. You need to decide if behaving like that is worth it, my young friend. Hmm. I'll leave it at that for now. But think about what I've said. That's it. Uh, I didn't see the husband anywhere. Get your miscellaneous items here. Move. It's pretty cool so far. Easy, simplistic. It's back here. Oh, this is where he is. Oh, found him. Along, we're busy. Oh, come here, my little sad. What? Uh, I, I was just um, I, I've never even met this woman. Who is she? Look, Sonny, keep your mouth shut about this, right? My wife's at home with our little ones, and I'm supposed to be working. That's a good excuse. But a man should be entitled to do what he likes, don't you think? He's got a point. He's got a point. If you keep this little secret, I'll give you a gold piece. Hmm. No. Just don't tell my wife. I can't let her find out about this. I love you more than any of the others, my little honey. I'm gonna go turn him in. Where is this Oakvale? He's an unpredictable chap, isn't he? Honestly, where's that filthy layabout husband of mine? <laughs> With some, I run his house. If you find, you have. Right. I'm gonna turn him into Balverine food. You get him. Thank you, young sir, for telling me. You're welcome. Uh, okay, so the green dots. Oh, I want to see what happens. Yo, filthy swine! I ought to chop them right off. Don't insult me anymore. My mother was right about you. Well, if you think I'm going to cook and clean for you while you're out having a good time with your stumping, you've got another thing coming. Who is she anyway? Some tart from the village? <sighs> Younger than me, is she? Please, my dear, I can explain everything. Yo, filthy swine! I ought to chop them right off. We weren't doing anything, honest. Hmm. Don't insult me anymore! My mother was right about you. All right, I just gotta repeat the same well, thing. Well, if you think I'm going to cook and clean for you, I thought it would advance a little bit, but eh, whatever. I'm expecting too much now. Brom. Sounds like uh, Aragon. I'm a man of my word, so here's the gold for your good deeds. Thanks, Pop. But if you think that I'll turn a blind eye to your mischief, you're very wrong. Try to keep out of trouble, please, for me. No. Well, I think you may have enough there, son. Have you spoken to the trader? Yes. So 
So I gotta go to the trader. Four gold. So I guess I did one extra. All right, trader. Give me three pieces. Yes. Young sir, they are yours. Wish your sister a happy birthday from me now, won't you? Yes. Whoa. That is some fancy looking chocolate. What does he got to say about it? Who can resist such sweet meats? Like, what? All right. To my sister, I what we go. I like wearing my flip flops. That's cool. There's the guard. Man, I can't believe I punched that kid. It's gonna make me evil forever now. At least it's not like uh, Fable 2 and 3, where if you do something bad, you start getting scars. I knew you were going to bring me chocolates. It's just like my dream. I bet it is. You'd have better dreams. Come on, let's go home. Mother will be back for my party any minute now. What's this? Oh, whoops. Wait, there's something wrong. Bandits! Is that a cheater? It's really happening. They're here. You've got to hide. How do they not see him? That's a lot of bandits. Evil had come to Oakvale. Bandits wielding torches and steel, slaying and burning all in their path. <laughs> the flames lit the night as the villagers screamed and begged for mercy. And soon, their bodies filled the streets. That's depressing. Then the raiders reached the last house. That's us. Boy and his family lived. It was them they had slaughtered so many to find. The father fought to protect his kin, but he was no warrior. He fell mortally wounded. The bandits ripped the house apart, but could not find the boy. Why are they looking for me? Through torture and threats, his mother and sister remained silent, and their furious attackers took them both. From the nearby woods, the boy watched as all he knew was taken away his whole life was crushed to ashes. He was alone. I'm all alone now. Oh, I can't search the dead bodies. Dead end. Go, go, go. Poor people. Oakvale is no more. Oh, I thought he was missing a leg for a second. Is that his dad? Looks like it. Is this going to be a game where my character doesn't talk? leave. It's not safe here. They're all dead. You don't want to join them, do you? Where's my sister? Then give me your hand. Why does his face look so weird? My guy.
from the smallest acorn. Hmm. Avatar Ward. Would you have a stronger stomach than that? Come on. Save your energy, boy. It's not me you want to fight. You might not realize it, but I just saved your life. There's nothing left for you in Oakvale. And if you'd stayed, you'd be as dead as the rest of them. Come with me. Do I follow him or do I punch him? My name is Maze, and I'm the head of the Guild of Heroes. Uh. You must have heard of it. You'll find nowhere safer in all of Albion, nor a better place to call your home. Albion. And if it's vengeance you want, you'll need the training only we can offer. Here we are. I'll introduce you to the Guildmaster. He'll be your guide from now on. Okay. A lot of cutscenes, goodness. I have a new student for you. Put him in the dorm upstairs with the girl. You don't look much like hero material to me, but Maze knows what he's doing, I suppose. Well, follow me then. Do I follow him? What what is the purpose of that? They couldn't just do that. Whisper one of our brightest young pupils. She's playing in the woods right now, but you'll meet her in the morning. For now, you should get some sleep. Your training starts tomorrow. Do I sleep? <laughs> it's time to wake up. You must be my roommate. Hmm. Shorter than I expected. My name's Whisper. I've been here for a month. Had the room to myself till now, too. But that's all right. You know you talk in your sleep. Sounded like a bad nightmare. Happens to a lot the first week. Some don't even last that long. You won't either if you don't get moving. The Guildmaster is waiting for us in the map room. You don't want to be late on your first day. Follow me. Did she just say the same thing twice in less than 20 seconds? Hmm. Looks like the Guildmaster got tired of waiting for you. He's probably at the training grounds across the river. Let's go! What's over here? Do we go? Where do I go? Do I go this way? Oh, this is a bar. Let's check it out. New expressions. This dining room is right. where the main meals <laughs> are served. The melee ring is outside, across the bridge. That's funny. This reminds me, that building reminds me of, uh... Oh, that froze for a second. It reminds me of, um... The, uh... Taverns and the dwarves' place in World of Warcraft. That's cool. So you're telling me that this entire town got raided by a couple of bandits. Just bandits. No allegiance to anywhere. The servants live in here. Mm. Listen, and then this these people here can do anything. For the guild at the end of the week. Okay. But I can't find any more red apples. I only need another four. So why is a little kid gonna if be any different? Enough, can you bring them back here? I'll reward you. Okay. Sure. I wonder if it tracks the quests. Oh, whoops. Uh... Oh. So it doesn't keep track of, like... 
your side quest. Interesting. Oh, I guess I'll just go down here. What is this? What? Okay. Hey. You find them? All right, lad. It's time to see if you've any potential. Get in the ring. Now then, I want you to hit that dummy as hard as you can. What? Just keep going till I tell you to stop. Oh my, that's not the thing to say to a kid. Not making much of an impact there, are you? Here, try with this. <gasps> a this whole city, he gives me a stick. Alright. So this is going to be a button masher. I like it. Ah, now that's more like it. When you destroy an enemy like this dummy, it drops an experience orb. These orbs contain the knowledge gained from killing the creature. It's very important that you collect these orbs, or you won't learn anything. Now pick it up. Okay, so I remember that. Well done, lad. Now then, tomorrow we'll... That's the guild alarm. Sounds like there might be something loose in the woods. This is a good opportunity to test your spirit. I'll wait for you at the guild woods entrance while you deal with the problem. Once you're done, we can talk about starting your training. Melee, kill the beetles infesting the guild woods. Get good deeds. 30 gold. Man, they look like Assassin's Creed people. Assassins. There we go. Is there nobody in here? Oh, maybe they're up. Let's go. Oh, no. The journey's length is of no consequence. The Oracle must be protected. How can you be so sure? We might need you here. Who knows what battles we might face. The signs are too strong to ignore, and the northern wastes have been too long isolated from the guild. There is much I may learn there. Well, I hope nobody thinks you're running away from a fight, trying to cheat death again. You know how people talk. Do they? Talk is of no matter to me. May death close his eyes to you, Maze. What are you waiting for? Come in. Oh, well, he knows I'm there. Scythe. He was a great hero once, back when he had flesh on his bones and blood in his veins. He's just a shell now. What does he know of the choices we have to make, of what it takes to get things done? I don't know. Do I follow him? No, boy. You're supposed to... Rep you can always find out where... Oh, okay. Sorry. Just trying to have fun. I'm gonna get out of here. There's nobody here. Do I talk to these guys? I did it in 50 seconds. No one has beaten that. We're discussing whether I'm the fastest apprentice in this guild. Okay. I ran to the demon door and back in 50 seconds. Beat that. Where? Right then. Get to the demon door and back and talk to me in 50 seconds. Where's the demon door? No chance. I'm the fastest guild apprentice by miles. I don't know where the demon door is. Where's the demon door? 
someone just shoot me? Why are they shooting me? Are you telling me they can't hit that close? Dude, I don't know where the demon door is. It's gonna have to wait. I'll go back to them. Is this the demon door? No. I failed. You're the most arrogant, that's for sure. You didn't even get to the demon door, so that run doesn't count. I'm the fastest! No, you're not. Is it over here? Yes, I am. Holder. Well, we're about 30 minutes in. I think this is a good spot to uh, call part one. Good way to get the intro out of the way and everything. Um, that was pretty cool.